Hey there, Gemini. This is your August 2022 reading. Let's see what's going on for Gemini. We have, ooh, we have Ace of Swords. So something new is coming in. You're starting something new. It's also a, like a transformation with the uh, dragonfly here. And also um, cutting things out that don't belong. And then, ooh, and with the Ace of Wands. Holy moly, look at this. Look at these new beginnings for you. Something passionate, some new, a baby, a new job, a new business. And then we have the devil. We might be dealing with a Capricorn. Um, and someone is a little, a lot of anxiety. Um, that could be you or this Capricorn. Let's see what else we have here. But new beginnings, new starts, new business, new, new adventures. Maybe some new passion here. Okay, remember with the devil here. Let's see. Well, we'll clarify. We'll see if the devil is a Capricorn or if the devil is an energy that is um coming in here let's see we have oh king of cups okay so you might be either cutting out a king of cups or king of cups is coming in having a conversation the truth comes out with the ace of swords um let's see we have king of cups scorpio cancer pisces and we also have a oh, castle this might be the king of the castle here or this person uh, wants to be together with you in the castle in the home you might live with this person. Okay, what about the um, Ace of Wands? Oh my gosh, look at this. Look at these Aces. Oh my God. We have the Ace of Pentacles. So, this is um, really nice. There's opportunities coming in galore for you. There's new beginnings. Uh, maybe a new business. Definitely something that you're very passionate about that's going to pay well. Okay, what about this... um? The devil card. Why is the devil card here? Oh, so you're walking away from me. You're walking away from a Capricorn. You're walking away from someone that maybe was possessive, obsessive, or um, you may be walking away from just uh, maybe someone walking away from addiction or um, someone overdoing something, maybe over drinking, over um, maybe walking away from just a way of life, a way of being. Uh, friends, maybe there's a toxic environment, but you're moving on from, and you're working on yourself. You're putting a lot of work in. This will this brought you a lot of anxiety and stress here. Okay, let's see. What else do we have here for Gemini? Let's see. I'm liking this reading. Whoa! Look, another Ace of Pentacles. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. You have such good things coming in for you. There's so many new beginnings that their potential is amazing for you. And we have, okay, so here you are. You might be standing above the rest, getting recognition here, um, standing out. I see these cards, you know, like maybe you have to fight off others for this, but it might, you're going to do well though. You're doing quite well. Yeah, something to do at work. You're doing really well at work. I, th I think a lot of you are starting your own business. This is really paying attention to your work and honing your craft, putting time in. Look, and here we have the seven of coins. You know, probably thinking about, should I put more time in? Absolutely. Look at all these aces coming in. Okay, let's see. Why do we have this ace of coins? Let's clarify this ace of coins, please. Why is the ace of coins here? Oh, the moon. Pisces energy. Okay, something might be hidden. A lot of emotions, so might be hiding their emotions, but they might want a commitment with you. Okay, what about this seven of wands? Okay, yeah, someone's coming in here with an offer. This could be a Scorpio Cancer Pisces, but they have a love offer for you. And there might be, you know, you might be standing above the rest. They might they might have other choices, but you're the one. And they want to talk to you. We got the parrot here. They might be repeating something they heard with the parrot. Parrot repeats. They might be coming to you to talk to you about something, saying they heard something. They want to, you know, find out if it's true. Okay, what about this three of coins? Wow, three of coins. So there's definitely a connection here. Someone wants to get together and work with you. They're going to make you an offer. I'm not sure if you're going to take it. You might say, I don't know if I want to take it with this person. I'm not sure. But there might be, you got to really pay attention to it because it might be an opportunity that might be good for you. You might not be seeing it. Not seeing the potential. Okay, we have here. Why did I do this? That was crazy. 
Okay. What for the... Oh, no, that's right. I'm sorry. I put these over here. I got myself confused. I'm right here. Okay. The Hierophant. Taurus energy. Commitment. This also could be an institution. A corporation. Something that's um very structured. Very like, formed here. Okay. Let's see what else we have. Whoa. Well, you're going to do quite well here. You're going to get noticed whatever's going on in your life. There's... Someone's really noticing you. I think you're getting noticed by a lot of different people, actually. And you, you're you standing ground. You've been through the battle here. Oh, we have the King of Coins. So this is Taurus Virgo Capricorn. It's also interesting. You've got a couple people interesting you. This also could be that you're doing quite well in your finances, your money. You're very stable, reliable. And we have a little pixie here. But I think this is like magical. Hidden things going on around you. They're not aware of it, but it's very magical. Let's see. Why do we have the Hierophant here? What's the story with this Hierophant? There it goes. That, see? Someone, I think, there, there's going to be an offer. Could be an offer for a job, a business. Could be in an institution, a corporation. Or it could be in love with this um, cup here. And you're not sure about it. Could be from a Taurus. Why do we have the Six of Wands? Ooh, the star. Wow, you are just standing bright. You might be famous or becoming famous because you have the star. It's like stardom. And then you also have the six of wands, which is victory, being out, you know, getting recognized for your worth. So some of you could become famous or really get recognized, be standing out. Hopes and dreams and wishes come true with the star. Aquarius energy. What about the nine of wands? Why is the nine of wands here? Okay, you're juggling something, trying to figure something out. You might be very protective over something that happened here. But there's a decision to be made. Um, you also might be traveling overseas. Or trying to decide if you want to travel. There might be an offer come in from overseas for some of you. And you're looking out at the distance, wondering if you want to do this. I feel like you're really contemplating something here about this decision. Because of how much you've been through. You're, you're a little wary, but you are very protective. Okay, let's see what the word is. Why is the... What's the word on this King of Cups? Let's see. What's the word on the King of Cups? I love these aces, though. Wow. We have love, excited, oh, future. So someone's coming in with a love offer. They want you to move into their castle, probably. Or they're offering you a castle. Hey, maybe it could even be a king that has a castle. But they're offering the, their love here for the future. They're speaking the truth, too, because it's on the Ace of Swords. So they're coming to you wanting to speak the truth to you. Now, what about this Knight of Cups? Sexual. Pleasure. Money. Okay. Wow. I mean, I'm going to say this because I got it. And I said someone might be asking you that they heard that you're providing sexual pleasure for money. Now, that's not, of course, not going to be for everyone. But here it is. It's like competing here. Also, this could be that, um, I don't know how else to put this. Wow. Kind of nuts. And, of course, that's not going to be for most of you. <laughs> okay, let's see. What about the King of Coins? I'm surprised my guys even said that. They might, I might think it and they tell me no not to say it, but that was different. Okay, money very soon. Thoughts. Thoughts. Someone, someone might be giving you money soon or something. This might be an offer too. I mean, it is a, a King of Coins, so it could be a boss someone in finances so very soon there might be money coming in or someone's thinking about giving you money offering you a job offering your position that would make sense too because very soon thoughts of money hmm this is quite different I didn't expect this but whatever everything else is going well for you I don't know why this came up I'm saying this probably isn't for most people 
The Knight of Cups come in with a love offer. Wow, they could be too. I mean, you are doing better than rest. So some people might be trying to spread rumors, maybe. I don't know. I'm trying to justify because it just seems like a... I'm surprised that came out. <laughs> okay, let's see. Whew, okay. Let's see, Gemini. That is crazy. <laughs> we have here... Cancer. Aquarius. Gemini. Libra. Oh, we got all the air signs. That doesn't happen too often. Taurus. And Taurus. Ooh, very strong Taurus. Plus, we have Taurus here. So, yeah, there's very strong Taurus energy for you guys. Okay, so this could be placed in your chart, placed in other people's chart. Past, present, and future. And we have Cancer, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Taurus, and Taurus. Okay, now, let's see what letters we have. This is going to be for... um. 11 letters, and it'll be for first name, last name. If you get both the first and last, you know someone's middle name, you get that all the better. Past, present, future, and also your own. Let's see. We have R, P, X, A, E, Y, V, R, O, Y, got Roy, and we have D. Okay, so the letters we have for today are R, P, X, A, E, Y, V, R, O, Y, D. Now, let me see what names we have. What are the names we have for you guys? What names want to come out? Let's see. here okay so we have Suzette S-U-Z-E-T-T-E -T -T -E. we have Jeremy J-E-R-E-M-Y um, Thimby T-H-E-M-B-I Carmen Lori L-O-R-I Lucy Ken Beth, Kelly, Martin, and Christina, what a K, K-R-I-S-T-I-N-A. And there's our 11. All right, guys. So remember, these are general readings, not personal readings. Please take what resonates, leave what doesn't, especially this. It's not going to be for too many people, I don't think. Okay, so, um, and please let me know if it resonates. Please leave comments. I love you guys so much and I appreciate all you like, share, subscribe, and comments. It really helps my channel to grow and keeps me on YouTube because without you guys, I can't be here. And um, I just appreciate you so much and I really want to be able to help more people too. So thank you. I hope to see you all again real soon.